They're asking me to like strafe the side of a wall. They're asking me to crouch run and, and do all this all over the room. And it's like a choreography of, of just gaming. So I have to ask about your audition for Red Dead. How did it go down? Did you know you were playing Arthur? No, I didn't even know it was for Red Dead. I didn't even know it was for Rockstar. Um, it was for Take-Two Interactive, so I started to do a bit of research on Google, and I had, a, I had a suspicion, but I had no proof whatsoever. They asked me to come in wearing boots and to prepare a Western accent. And I got these sides. It was modern day, you know. It was about a guy going into a bar, and uh, he was talking to his bartender, who he knows, and they had a relationship, you know. And the bartender was talking about how his daughter's coming over to visit. And they're like, oh, that's nice. And then at the end of the short, it was about two pages or whatever. And then at the end, I go, okay, well, I got to kill you now. Someone's put a price on your head. And he's like, what? And I'm like, sorry, bud. So I did that. And then they asked me, like, just because it's performance capture nowadays now, you know, so much of it is still voice acting. But loads of it now is also performance capture. So they're asking me to, like, strafe the side of a wall. They're asking me to crouch run and, and do all this all over the room. And, it's like a choreography of, of just gaming, where you, you're going around with a gun and you're hiding behind a door and whatnot. So they, half of the times, I swear, I just got that job because of the way I walk. Because they knew, I mean, except when you're on horseback, you're looking at Arthur walking like 90% of the time, right? So you want to get a walk that doesn't get on your nerves. Did they get you on a horse? <laughs> I actually didn't go on a real horse for Red Dead. I am a rider, and I can jump, and it's been a while. But yeah, I knew how to ride, but they brought horses in on another week. They, we did, the actors didn't actually get on them. We went on to steel barrels with pipe stick, four pipes sticking out on either end, and they strapped a saddle on the oil barrel. So it was dimensionally accurate. And there was a little head, too, and with some rope around but that's all that we ever worked with. And then they got all the horse animations out in like, I think two weeks. Otherwise they would have had to shovel up all the poop and all that, you know. <laughs> and getting the balls to stick on their fur, you know. So they crunched it out really quickly, all the horse animations. It was pretty amazing.